everybody it's june and as you all know i am on the ketogenic plan and i'm so excited and in this video i'm going to show you how to make bread what bread toasted bre bread on the keto how is that possible in 90 seconds so if you want to know how to make this bread just keep watching Okay, so let's talk about what we need here to make 90 second bread. I'm telling you guys, this is so easy, so, such a, it'll be a staple in your keto plan. So I know that it is for me. And like I said, I am in no way an expert. This is all new to me. This is really new to me, but I have been doing my research and I'm really excited to be able to share this with you guys so here we go okay so what you need is number one ingredient is almond flour you can find this in your grocery store you get like a bit i think that the name of it is red mill i'm not too sure um i will put the link down below if you cannot find it in your grocery store then you can order it through amazon and you get a nice size bag so you need almond flour i put it in here in uh like my little baggies i separated them you need baking powder any type of baking powder. You need pink Himalayan salt. I, I've heard of this before keto, but um, since being on keto, I know how crucial it is to have um, pink Himalayan salt in your diet, your, your everyday diet. So it's very good. It has really good nutrients and you need this. You need a spoon, a cup. Now I'm using this type of Cup. I'm going to be putting this in the microwave, but you can use a mug. You can use a something that has a larger base because the larger the bottom is, the more wider your, your bread will be. Like I've done it in a mug and I got like little discs out of it. So that wasn't good for me. I'm doubling this recipe. Oh, you need also measuring spoons. So I'm doubling this recipe. And you can double it, you can ha you know, you can make it half, which was the original recipe. But I, I found that making the double recipe just gave me more bread. And more bread is uh, more better. Should I say more better? I know that's not correct. Is better. Okay, so let's get started. So for this bread, you need six tablespoons of almond flour. So... We're gonna do that. Six tablespoons. Okay. There are so many ingredients with almond flour. <gasps> three, right? That was three. That was three. Four. Five. got two eggs <laughs> the main ingredient this is what holds it all together the eggs okay so don't mind me I'm a little crazy okay so you need one teaspoon of baking powder like so put it in there you need some pink Himalayan salt you can put Parmesan cheese in this just to give it a little more of a, uh, like a salty flavor. You know, just a little bit because it can taste a little bland, but who cares? We've got bread and we're going to crack two eggs in here. That's really it. We're going to stir it up and we're going to put it in the microwave for 90 seconds. Yeah. So let me stir this up and I'll show you the consistency. I have to tell you guys this this plan is the best thing I've ever done and like I said in my other video being diagnosed with diabetes I, I take it as a blessing in disguise because I, I, I feel like it really helped me get focused on what I have to do for my life to um, get healthier I think it's it's so important to 
especially in my age, you know, 50 years old, that's when all the things start coming in, the diabetes, the pain in, in the body, just everything, the eyesight start, starts going. So I think it's important that you take care of your body. And I have to tell you, um, when I first started this, I watched on Netflix, there's a, um, a movie called The Magic Pill. And basically it's it's about the ketogenic plan and what good it does for people as far as I mean I'm not saying it would do this if you have a child with autism or you're autistic or something but there was um, an autistic child that changed the parents changed the child's diet and made it a keto plan and this is a child that never spoke before and all of a sudden the kid like after a few days the kid started speaking I mean, it, it, it's amazing. Okay, so it is all incorporated in there. This is what it looks like, can you see? This is the consistency. It looks like a looser almond butter. So, what I'm gonna tell, I'm so excited. This is so exciting. So, I just bang it on the table just to get the air bubbles out. I'm gonna put this in the microwave for 90 seconds and I'm gonna show you what it looks like when I come back. Stay right there. Okay, so here is the bread. Look at that. We're gonna take it out of here. We're gonna let it cool down and I'm gonna slice it up. So first, I wanna just get it, just clean the knife. So just wanna get all around it. Just loosen it up from here. And then we're going to flip it over. Hopefully, there we go. Look at this. I am going to let this cool off and then I will be back. I will slice it up and I will show you what it looks like. But now to cut this delicious bread. Okay, oh, look at it. I know it looks a little weird, right? And it, it comes out like that, but that's fine. That's fine. So now we take our knife and I'm going to cut. Actually, I'm going to cut this way. I'm going to cut the top off. We can save this. You know that you can make this, you can toast this and make this into croutons. Look at the texture on that. Let me see. Show you. It's bread, guys. It's bread. Okay. I know I have no nail on. Oh. Perfect for sandwiches. You can have your turkey, your cheese. Look, you can make it as thin as you want, as thick as you want. It's totally up to you. So I get about four nice size slices. What? I like to make my eggs. I like to toast this, put a, some butter on it, and dip it into my eggs. And you know what? You can take this with you, put it in a little baggie. You go to a restaurant. There you have your bread. Look at this. Come on, look at this. Look, we've got bread. So now I'm going to show you what I'm having for breakfast. Stay right there. Here is my breakfast. I have two eggs over medium. I have one slice of the keto bread. I have it buttered and cut in half, and I have my delicious bacon. So yeah, this is how I love to eat my eggs. I love to break the yolk. Look, break the yolk. Take my bread, now I'm not missing anything. Dip it in there. Look at that. Can you see that? Look at that. It is absolutely delicious. Yep. So I am going to be posting a lot more recipes on here. I'm going to be doing maybe a pizza recipe, a bagel recipe. If you guys want to know more about keto, I'm going to put my friend's um, YouTube channel down below um and joe go check it out and go check it out like like if you want to know about keto wait i have to take a bite uh -uh. 
I'm sorry guys. Mm -mm. If you want to know about what you can eat, <laughs> mm, stop it. Different recipes, what you should do, what you shouldn't do. I will put her, and she also has a Facebook page if you're interested in becoming part of her keto family. Her name is Lori. You can just go on her page. <clears throat> Excuse me. I gotta go eat breakfast, guys. I gotta go eat breakfast. Anyway, I hope you like this video. Give it a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this, how I make different recipes. Um, leave a comment down below. If you make this or other things, I would love to connect with you. Maybe we can share recipes. And I hope I see you guys in my next video. Subscribe if you're not a subscriber. Bye, guys. I gotta go eat. I have to eat. I must eat.